ta ina le de o o kuku parada ina le de o o kuku parada ina le de o o kuku parada almighty god the god of our flesh the king of all things the god who does exceedingly the god who does abundantly and the god who does above we worship your name today we honor you and we give you praise thank you lord for life thank you lord for godliness and thank you lord for everything in between i worship your name today i honor you father the king of glory the almighty the god that does all things well to you be all the glory to you be all the honor thank you lord for the gifts of life for waking us up today oh god for all that you did with us yesterday jesus we honor you jesus we honor you jesus we honor you jesus we honor you we worship your name we glorify you and we give you praise zanta libra do kese galega do zekete libra do zanta ye maketa li jesus kalebro do gozoko to ye gede jesus sakanda libra hanzekete ye mado thank you lord for your power Thank you Lord for your authority that you've delegated to us. Thank you for daily loading us with benefit. Thank you for speaking your word at all times in all seasons for us to follow. Thank you for being kind. Thank you for being merciful. Thank you Jesus. Thank you for provision. Thank you for protection. Thank you for mercy. Thank you for kindness. Father, to you be all the glory. To you be all the honor. To you be all adoration. I worship you today. I honor you today. I give you all the praise. Thank you, Father, for who you are, for all that you have done, for all that you are doing. I worship you oh God. I worship you oh God. I worship you oh God. I bow before your throne. Zeketa ligada. Zekete ligada Buddha. Shekete li maduka singa lagade. Zekele baduka sika li made. I give you all the praise. 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 I honor you. I worship you. I bow before your throne. Thank you Lord Jesus for life. Thank you Lord Jesus for godliness. Thank you for all things in between. My king and my maker, the God of all flesh. I worship you today. I honor you, O God. Zekete legele bagadu kasigale magadekete. Brazu de kete kasukata yema zanda libra do kosoko te zakate liga da giba do de de Jesus 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 I honor your name brazu kete liga de ge de bo I bow before your throne zakete liga da gadiga zakete libra do de ge de ge bogo zakanta yega la gida brother. Zokoto legede kasukata lima zade de bodo kosondo yeke teli gada badu. Jesus, I honor you. Jesus, I worship you. Jesus, I bow before your throne. Jesus, I give you praise. Unchanging God, the God that is able to do all things, the immortal God, the invisible God, the only wise God. I honor your name today. Thank you Jesus. 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 
I worship you. I worship you. I worship you. Zeketele gadi gadaboko sundo yema. Zelele de bagu takati. Zigali gadi baduke shente ye baduka. Zeketele gadi gadabo. Zegede de de baduka singa la made. Bato sunto ye keta liba. Jugele baduka zika taye made. Jesus, I worship your name. Jesus, I worship your name. Jesus, I worship your name. I honor you this morning. Thank you for every member of CYM. Thank you for their households. Thank you for the things you've done. Thank you for the things you are doing. Thank you for the things you will do. You are the King Majestic. You are the God of all flesh. Father, I worship your name. Zeke Telega Liga Laba. Zinda Libra Doko Sokote. Zantila Kasege de Baku Sandayema. Jesus, thank you. To you be all the glory. To you be all the honor. To you be all adoration. Almighty, all sufficient. The God who is kind. I honor you, O God. Zeka Talege Lebadu. Zebra Dogo Sekete Yemade. Ziga Liga Liga Daka Tekede. Zopra Tu Sandaye Mede. Thank you for going. Thank you for coming. Thank you for everything in between. Immortal, invisible, only wise God. The God that decrees a thing from the beginning and establishes it at the end. The God that knows the end of a thing from before it's begun. The God that is kind. The God that is powerful. The God that is merciful. The King of glory. I honor your name today. 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 Almighty, all sufficient, kind God, merciful King, um, um, unchanging God, we honor you. Zeke te lega de go so kote lega lage. Ade de de boko so to liba. Akasi da de de de. Ekasi kalima do. Jobreke seke te liga do. Zunga diga diga dege de baduka sanda, sheta legeba, zubre de de bodo, zukandila makasiga de, zekete libraduga ziketa limade, boson de ye katila made, gasuta yege legeba do, jubra di de dege sekele, zunto le baduka sikata yiba, jubre de geda gatatu yo mekete, eze de bazunda li. Zuva dida broto sonta yeka sakatole braduka sekinda yemado o zoto le bradiga zika talege o koso kolege tekele zoto le madika sekete jobra tu se gaduga de zandaliga de katoso ya jobre de de gede gaduka sukanda yema Jesus thank you 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 Jesus, thank you. Jesus, thank you. Zege de ge de ge de bo. Zeke te liga la gada ge. Zatolo madega zeke te le. Zeke te liga la ge de ge de bro. Eke seke te li ba ge seke te li makasa ke te li. Leke seke te li ba dege seke te li bradu de de. Ege seke te li ba gu seke nda ye matoko so. Eke seke de na ke seke te li bradu. Aza da tu te kete li madoko soko tele made. Ege se kete li brado duge se kete. Ege se kete li ga za tuta ye made kese. Ege se te le madatu soko to li brade. Ege se kete li maduko sende le kete. Lazu de de gede poto soko to li made gadu gadu zandela. Aze gede de de kete li katu la miga. Je de de bako se kente le. Je brado de ga zika ta ye made. Jesus, we honor you. 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 We worship you. We worship you. We worship you. We worship you. Jesus, we worship you. To you be all the praise. Thank you for the gift of life this morning. Thank you for restoration. Thank you for replenishment. Thank you for grace. Thank you for mercy.
Thank you for vested authority. Thank you for delegated authority. Thank you for power in your name. Thank you for power in your blood. Thank you for deliverances. Thank you for mercy. Thank you for daily loading us with benefits. Almighty, we worship you. Almighty, we worship you. Almighty, we worship you. We honor you, O God. We give you all the praise. Zekata ligade. Zebra do kosunto yema. Zakata yiga liga 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 lagede. Zekete lebrodo do zunto yumateka. Jesus, thank you. I honor your name. I honor your name. I honor your name. I worship you. I glorify you. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. We give you all the praise. We give you all the praise. We give you all the praise, O God. In Jesus' mighty name, amen and amen. Good morning, everyone. Welcome to the call. If you've shared the link, thank you for sharing the link. If you are yet to share the link, could you please share the link? God bless you as you share the link in Jesus' name. Brasukete kata lagade bodo. Zopreke seketa liga lagade. Zandele bratu kasege lege. Asukanta yege lege. Brasukete lege de gebo. Jakata liga lagede gede boko sonto yima. Zeke lege gade katu lagi badu gazikata lege da buka sunda ye makata yege. Jesus, I honor you. I worship you. To you be all the praise, O oh God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I honor you. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Good morning. Welcome. If you shared the link today, we're going to pray. And we're going to do the work of intercessors. We're going to do the work of intercessors. So I'm going to encourage you. So shift from you for a moment and pray for other people. Pray for people on the call. Pray for people not on the call. Just do the work of intercessors this morning. Do the work of intercessors this morning. Remember to pray for the nation of Nigeria. And thank God for what he's doing. Whether you see the, what he's doing or not, thank God. Just open your mouth and intercede this morning. I'll watch the charts and I'll possibly intercede along with you concerning a specific thing. But I'm going to be interceding for all of you this morning. Brasuketeliga. <laughs> Zebra do de gay de gay de bado. Zokoto ye me gadiga de gada badu se kente ye mado. Aziga liga de gadega de be. Jondolu madeka se kete liga da game. Egeze. O suta ye madu sandali kasa bade. Vese pratu sundo ye katila gida bado. Zekete lega da giga da gede kataluma. Lord, we thank you. We bring before you, O God, everyone who's waiting on you for the fruit of the womb this morning. Brasuketa yege lege de badu sundo. Zadada di da da keketele. Zekete lega di badade. Zekete li maduka sege lega de. Zandale bra du kasege le bogo sokondo yeba. Zubrada da deke sekende le madu. Zukaliga libra du zekenta yiga liga da bo. Jopreke sakan. Gaza kata yegede. Osunda ye meketa liga liga da bo. Zekete liga dega da bega sakunda. A zubrede kasukete. Gazunde leba kushakanda yekete. Zubradu de kete katu kasiga lima katoga. Zembrade katoka zege de ba. Zumbele gadi kasi kata ye mede. Zopreke sekenda ye kata liga da gaduke segede. Azaga di bado, ege dege de lege de ketege, eze pralu madu kasegele, zumba lu megete ketele magu sagada, jeketele brado, zumba li magi sekanda, jegelege de geboko sondo ye kata, zubra di gazike talimade. Father Lord, your word says that children are a reward. Father Lord of those who serve you. In the name of Jesus, we speak, O oh God, concerning your children who are waiting on you, O oh God. They trust in you, they serve. 
serve you. Father Lord, that's why they come to you rather than go to man. Father Lord, you the God who is a rewarder. Father Lord, reward them with the fruit of the womb. In the name of Jesus. Braku segeda gita kansandalu makita ke. Zendeli braka suke tele gede baku sagada. Jeke tele batu sekinda yimato. Zubrege zeka te yibatu senda yimata. Lord, we worship you. 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 We honor your name, Jesus. We bow before your throne. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. In the name of Jesus. We want to come before God this morning to uh, to contend against cancer. We want to inv- invite the host of heaven to join us in contending against the demon of cancer. Zubre de de kasuka tayema do. Zuntolumba de kasuka tila braduke sende yema. Jokoto lege de geda ba. Zumbre de geda kutakata yega. Zopeteke le maguzakita yikata. Zandalu braduke sekete ye makatula gida geba do. Jokoto le braduka sinda ye meketa yiga laga. Zabrado to sekete ye mekete ligade. Zede baduka siga lima kanzande kete yeba. Azupre kete lega zupete te yema. Zubre de dega sukata yema katoga. Zekelega dube henda lima kisa kinda yika tu la giga da boda. Jobre gezegende kato. Zupre kete yu maduka sekete. Father Lord, we declare that this morning your spirit will raise a standard against cancer and in every form, shape, and manner, in the name of Jesus. Father Lord, for everyone at every treat, a stage, a stage of treatment, Father Lord, we ask that your spirit will show up today. We ask that you would fight for your children, O oh God. In the name of Jesus. Zabrakute ke kaluma. Zekeleboko soko toye madeka. Zanteye ke teli bradu gedega doga. Zundali madika sikatali madoke. Ozo ke kaluba dega zuka teye meka tu lagida buzenda. Juprakatoko toye ke tali makuse ke teye badu. Azendali makute lege de gedeba kusanda ye gado. Zupra kusenda in the name of jesus lord god in heaven we intercede oh god for comfort for those who are bereaved in this time you oh god of all comforts in the name of jesus we ask that you comfort your children sa kande ye mado zumbre de gadiga teke 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 kotolu badiga zege de badu mahinda ye kalo o zubra ku sakinda ye mekete ye ketele je badu zege de ge bakatu ye magadu gadiga zinkata je kele bago sokonda ye mekete ye ga azege le badu ka sandali makasa gedege zakata le madeke sende ye bado basu keteli gade Zoto li bradu ke sege lega diga da kantu ye mege de bo. Aka suge lege de ge de ge. Abra zute ke te lege de bo. O zoto lu bradiga zika ta. Zege lege de ge ke ke se ke te le baku sandele made. Juka ta de ke te te kalugo soko lo bade. Aga se ke te lege bo do. Azu gedega duka singa le madea. Jika lebo koso ndeyeba. Zumbredega suka tayegege. Zantulemega soko tolubra dageda. Zumbelegeda goto suke tele madiga zigalaku tayeba do. Jundele magisanda yeke telegedeba. Ozundele magusa kanda yeke telega. Ozo to yubra diga zeke te ye magu zanta yeba do. Jubra duke senda yeke telega. Zumbedika suka tali Lord, we thank you for your healing. Lord, we thank you for your healing. We thank you for your comfort. We thank you for your grace. We thank you for your mercy. We thank you for the things you do. Kozande. Bashuke Kaluge de Gaduka Senda Yemakatu. Jesus, thank you. We worship your name. We worship your name. We worship your name. We worship your name. 
We honor you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. 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 We honor you, O God. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I want us to come this morning and talk to God about those things that he's demanding glory from us concerning. Those things that he's demanding glory from us concerning. I want us to come before God today and talk to him about the things that he's demanding glory from us concerning. Whether you know where exactly he's asking you to show forth his glory or you're just in the place of discovery, come to God this morning. I could loop her hands and take it. Azeke telega dika sika tayema. Zobre de deka suka tayeme gede. Zundali maduke seke telega duba de. Ezinte ye patu sakinda ye kete. Ozo to lubra duka singe de geba du. Juke telebra du gezeke teyema duka zege. Azundali makoto koto libra da gazeke te. Zundoli braku seke teyema dika singa duga de. Ozo praku sege de geba tu sundo ye meke telegada. Lord, for every single one of us that your breath is upon. Father, Lord, and you are demanding glory and you are requesting glory. In the name of Jesus, I bring us all, O oh God, under the cross. <coughs> Lord, that we would receive a release and an understanding, O oh God, of where you want us to deliver glory from. Zadi brado ko sundo ye makisa gida diga 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 daga bute singa da da do. Abra ze de de gadu kasinga lima. Zegede bodo ko shundo ye matika saga de gade. Abru zundo ye mekete li gadu gadi badu kasinga lima kate ye gede gede. Azu de 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 baga zika talima guze gede boko shundo ye makate. Brazu de 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 bagata te ye madika sanda ye kete lego dogo. Brasike de ge bakatu le mega zakanta yigaloga de. O zuda di da biga zika tali magida gade. Zotodo do badika siga diga li magita kita yiga lagado. Zobre de 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 bagadika sika taye maguso konda yeke telega. Zumbeli mahika ti la gida gado ko sonde ye baraduda. Jikalagabege zente yema. Zupregeza kuta ye megadiga de. Zundoli baduka sukata ye magiza gade da doko sonde ye. Zopra ko sende de de baga tukata ye magadiga do. Zigaliga du bege zenta ye makatuluga zigaliga doba. Zupekete ye megaduga zukanta ye gelegedege. Zundoli braga zukete gedege de gadabusunda yumadika sikatu ya geda. Jupeteke tato ta ye makisanda. Zigalabege zenta yuma kataliga dega. Zupreka sunde ye meketa. Zukete brodo zundali makisande liga duga dega de. Bra zukete le madika sinda yika taliga labado. Zubra ku zekete ye madika sinda le makashiga laga. Zekete lege de badu. Azunte ye matusa kataliga bradu zente ye badu ke sendele. I need you to pray that the cup will be moved. That the cup will be relieved, removed. That whatever it is that is capping the glory in, whatever it is that has trapped the glory on the inside, that that cup be removed today. Basuko to le mega zika tali gade. Zunde le gaduka zika tali brada guse kete. Zokota yi madiga ziga la gade gadeka to yu madika singa dadu de. Bato sokoto liga dage da beka sandi ya mika tali ga la goto to yege lege bo. Asunda li braduke se kete yege lege dadu. Ziga li gaduka ti ya miga se kete libado. Zandele bragu se kete ye makusa kanda yege dege. 
Zalopede kasanda yekele boko sondo yeba. Jiga liga diga diga baka sundele makuse gedege. Zubra du kasende ye matu sakanda yiga lagudo. Zopa tu segelege gado. Jubra diga zakanta ye makuse gedede. Zodole badu sekenda ye makuse geda. Junda lika telege lebado. I want us to begin to intercede for Nigeria this morning. Agezendele brahu zekete. Zubrege zeka tu katu ya magado. Zokoto libraga zekete. Sente ye makusa kanda ye gede. Aziga liga da gede bo. Jubra dige se kenta ye makuta. Zegele gede bagosonda ye gazika tali maguta ka ye gaga. O shotole badu. O ziga liga de gade. Zumba lima dika sika. O zikata yubre de gazuka ta yema. O zonto ye kete liga lika ta ye. Zabre de gade keta yo makasuga ligada. Zumbele maguseke. Zakuta lega da bo. Zoko libra du. Zumbele makatuke. Zekele gede gadu. Zumba liga diga da gede. Gasuka ta ligete boko soto le magisa kenda yi katale Zubre de 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 gadiga da buna Zembalu maduko soko te yege lega bakatu Jimbali makoto lega dage gaduka suga Zebra do koto ye mege dage dage daga tata Gazandale pato zegele magasika te Zokete ke leba gosanda ya mege dakita kate ke lebo Zubra gazenta ye meke telege Father we bring Nigeria oh God We are thankful for your power We are thankful for your glory we are thankful for your mercy we are thankful for your grace we are thankful oh god for your mercy jukali magazige gaduga duga zuntaye zobrede gazuka taye megida gadoga duka taye gadegede father thank you father thank you father thank you thank you for nigeria because nigeria is working Thank you because Nigeria is working. 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 Thank you, Father, because Nigeria is working. Thank you, Lord, because Nigeria is working. Zekete lega da. Zadu de de badu kasanda. Jekete libra du zeketa yema. Zumba li maku sekete liga du gade badu. Father, thank you. Indeed, because men are drawn to the light of Nigeria. Thank you, Jesus, because there is peace. Thank you, because there is order. Thank you because the land prospers. Basukele magis and tayi galogu to be. Jedede badika siga limakata yegede. Jesus, I worship you. Jesus, I worship you. Thank you, Jesus. 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 We worship your name. We worship your name. We worship your name. We worship your name. We honor your name, Jesus. Have your way, Father. Let your light show forth in every darkness represented on this call this morning. Everywhere there is darkness, oh God. Your word says that the darkness cannot comprehend light. Father, let your light show forth. 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 I honor your name, Jesus. I worship your name, Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. To you be all the praise. To you be all the praise. To you be all the praise. I honor your name. Thank you. 
in Jesus mighty name amen and amen brethren please share the link I don't know why we're sharing less and less please share the link so that others may come in please do so God bless you in Jesus name please share the link God bless you God bless you good morning and welcome to the prayer call today I want us to um, drill slightly um, I want us to focus briefly on this mission that we're talking about this idea that God wants glory out of us and what it will take as we go on I'm not sure that I'm doing this in the sequence they should go I'm still a bit tired but I know that anything I do in the next maybe one week would dovetail into the idea or into the revelation that God is asking us to show him our glory so yesterday I had a conversation with a big sister and she had called me for something else but she went off on something that could have been a tangent if I wasn't listening but I knew it was God who was speaking to me one statement she made was that she was telling me how she went somewhere to minister and before she went because she had been she, she had been invited and she said yes but the Holy Spirit has said to her not to go or whether to go and not go up on the stage and the reason that they, they was given to her was that the demons in this environment of vicinity know you you may not know them but they know you and she repeated that a number of times she was asking me she was actually counseling me to do things in a particular way to go in a certain direction that was why she was talking to me but I was paying attention and that statement stuck out they know you you may not know them because I was tired I didn't pursue it I just went when she finished talking to me I went back to sleep because I woke up from sleep to take the call um, but this morning as I woke up God started to remind me of that statement and then he started to speak in a certain direction I don't know if I'm correct but I know I I don't know if you would agree that I'm, I, I'm correct but I know that I'm correct that a number of us right now who were at rot or engaged with the rot conf prophetic conference are the place where we're saying how do I do what they want me to do what is the order in which I will do the things that I want I've been, you know, I feel like the Lord is asking me to do. And all that and all that. And some of us, this trying to figure it out in our minds will be the reason we don't step up. Others of us, we will step up, but at some point we'll probably hit a snag because some things will unravel in front of us that we do not understand. And because we do not understand them, we can begin to go back into our share and say, if that's how it's going to be, it's too difficult, I will not do it. In Acts chapter 19, I see Paul. If you remember, Paul was commissioned in Acts chapter 9. But in Acts chapter 19, I see Paul in the region of Ephesus. And he started to teach from verse 1 to verse number, let me say verse number 10, it chronicled how Paul was teaching 
in the churches, in the church in Corinth, you know, in Ephesus, where he found some disciples. How he asked them about the Holy Spirit. And so they said, oh no, we do not even know anything about the Holy Spirit. How he started to teach them the doctrine of the Holy Spirit. How he baptized them again. And they received the baptism of the Holy Spirit. And how people began to believe and confidently accept and joyfully believe in Jesus. You will see that in verse number 4. And how things started to change and men began to speak with an unknown tongue. And how from that point on, he went into synagogues and started to boldly speak. But he realized that the synagogue were not um, responding, accepting what he had brought. So he left and went to the streets and he started to teach. And how the fame of Jesus started to spread in that region. In verse 11 which is where I want to begin to read from, because what I want to talk about here is captured from verse 11. It says, God was doing extraordinary and unusual miracles by the hands of Paul, <coughs> so that even handkerchiefs of face towels or aprons that had touched his skin were brought to the sick, and their diseases left them, and the evil spirits came out of them. Then some of the traveling Jewish exorcists rather, also attempted to call the name of the Lord Jesus over those who had evil spirits, saying, I implore you and solemnly command you by the Jesus whom Paul preaches. Seven sons of one named Sceva, a Jewish chief priest, were doing this. But the evil spirit retorted, I know and recognize and acknowledge Jesus. And I know about Paul, but as for you, who are you? Then the man in whom was the evil spirit leaped on them and subdued all of them and overpowered them so that they ran out of the house in terror, stripped naked and wounded. This became known to all who lived in Ephesus, both Jews and Greeks. And fear fell upon them all, and the name of the Lord Jesus was magnified and exalted. Verse 18, many of those who had become believers were, be were coming, confessing, and disclosing their former sinful practices. And many of those who had practiced magical arts collected their books and throwing them book after book on the pile, began burning them in front of everyone. They calculated the value and found it to be 50,000 pieces of silver. So the word of the Lord concerning eternal salvation through faith in Jesus, in Christ, was Get growing greatly and prevailing. Hallelujah. So, number one, you need to know that we have been delegated. We have what is called delegated authority from Jesus. And if you go with me with Acts to Acts chapter 16, verse number 17. Acts number 16, verse number 17 and 18. Jesus was speaking and he said, These signs we follow them. We are accompanying those, those who have believed. In my name, they will cast out demons. They will speak in new tongues. They will pick up serpents. And if they drink anything deadly, it will not hurt them. They will lay hands on the sick and they will get well. Hallelujah. These signs will accompany those who have believed. In my name, they will cast out demons. So your authority comes upon you from the place of believing. Now, I know many things would be said to us. And yes, we need training. We need spiritual cover. All of those things are necessary, necessary in the establishment of systems and structures so that you can harness your gifts properly. But what essentially ordains you to do this work is that Jesus, you believe in Jesus and because of that, he's delegated authority to you. His delegated authority to you. And when you step out <coughs> in that delegated authority, of course, assuming that you live according to the standard that you've been given, according to the standard, if you live according to that standard, you will find that you are able to 
you are able to do the things that you need to do. You'll find that you are able to exercise yourself in the gifts and callings of God. Why? Because you believe and you are living according to what you believe. Two things that I really think that the Holy Spirit wants me to highlight this morning is for those of us who are going crazy, you're having a meltdown because you really want to do this work, but you have no clue. The Bible says if you believe, you will do. If you believe, you will do. It is the first and most important. Let me use the word again, ordination that you need. If you believe, you will do. But then, you see, you have to know to believe. That's the second thing I want to highlight. I want to highlight to you the account of the seven sons of Sceva. The Bible said that they were Jewish exorcists. What me that meant was that they were paid to exorce, um, excise um, evil spirits from those who were possessed and oppressed. And these ones came and start, decided to do what Paul was doing. Because they said Paul, when he showed forth as he was teaching, you see, that's the power of this authority. You don't necessarily have to begin to apply things on people. If you just carry that authority, you carry it. And that authority is processed in the place of intimacy with God. You need to know him for yourself, yes. And you need to know him deeply, yes. So the training that I think is most important, pay attention to me, it's not the training of how to cast out demons that is more important when you are building this foundation. The training that is most important is the training to know God for yourself. To know him, to know him, to know him, to know how God does with you, to know how he speaks to you, to know how he sends you, to know his voice for you, to know how he manifests around you. That is the most vital foundation you need. Everything else will be easy if you know God well for yourself. So do not be too overly excited or overly in, um, 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 focused on how will I cast out demons? How will I do this and how will I do that? I want you to focus on growing in Christ by yourself. I want you to not just do commanding your money and do your church services. I want you to read books. I want you to study the Bible. I want you to listen to uh, other people, um, ministers, that the Holy Spirit, tell Holy Spirit, lead me to ministers on YouTube or wherever. Let him train you. What I need you to do is not, or what God needs us to do, is not how to deliver people from demonic, demonic influence first. What God needs us to do is to know him by his word. Is to know him by his word. When Paul came into Ephesus, he wasn't overly concerned about casting out demons. Guess what he was focused in? He was co focused on teaching people about the gospel. He was focused on teaching people the gospel of Jesus Christ. He was focused on telling them who Jesus was. He was to, uh, focused on telling them the authority that exists in Jesus. He was focused on telling them how to align with the word of God. That was his focus. And because that was his focus, things started to happen. Because Jesus, it's like this, it says, if I be lifted up, I will draw all men to me. Do not be too concerned about whether your ministry is a deliverance minister or a teaching ministry or whatever ministry. That's not what it should be. Do not be so, so focused on, let me quickly write a book to show that I know God. Spend the time in learning. As you learn, God will take you by the hand. You will not miss your way. Because you will hear his voice. It says you will hear your voice, a voice behind you saying this is the way, walk in it. <clears throat> he will bring you to things. And when he brings you to things, if you require a tutor and a teacher in that space, he will manifest that tutor and teacher. 
You won't need to beg. You won't need to find yourself in doing things that are not convenient. He will hold on to you and he will get it done. Please pay attention to me. Do not be so interested, overly interested in the output that the input is not solid enough. I guess that's what I'm saying. Because the sons of Sceva came and they saw that, wow, it is possible in the name of Jesus to cast out demons. It probably was easier and faster than what they knew to do. So they showed up in the arena. They did not bother to know Jesus. They did not even bother to know what Paul knew. They just showed up and they declared. They say in the name of the Jesus that Paul preaches. And the demons turned and looked at him and looked at them and said, in verse number four, uh, sorry, verse 15, it says, Jesus, I know, Paul, I know, but as for you, who are you? And then the demons started to beat and torment them. Delegated authority is not the same as attempted stolen authority. Delegated authority is not the same as attempted stolen authority. Or authority that you just borrow. I don't know how whether that expression is the right word. The word borrow. You cannot dispense glory unless you know the one who gives glory. There is no amount of trying. There is no amount of huffing and puffing. There is no amount of shouting and screaming. There is no amount of hocus pocus that dispenses the glory of God if you do not know him. So, Stabi, I'm growing. Commanding your money has helped me grow. Only to an extent. You need to engage with these things by yourself. Engage with what God has brought you to. It's work, I know it. It's work, I know it. Every time I try to understand too many steps ahead of me, I have a migraine. And I begin to lose my equilibrium. I begin to just find myself going crazy. So on my journey, I have focused on learning what the Father will put in front of me at each time. I have focused more on learning. And as I learn and he gives me instructions, I receive the grace and boldness to follow through on the instructions. That's how I am able to get any kind of result so far. Any kind of result so far. Brethren, what I might say. I am saying please don't focus too much on outputs. That you do nothing about what is, should be on the inside of you. I am saying lay your foundation properly. Before you begin to build anything on top of it. I am saying don't take my word for it. Go and stay with God by yourself. And let him give you word. I'm saying don't take man's word for it. I'm saying sit with God and let it be done. How he wants it to be done. Do not be distracted, brethren. I don't even know if I'm making sense. I don't know if, I'm, if what I'm supposed to be communicating to you, I'm doing it properly. But if you didn't hear anything at all, I said, take your time and build up from the inside out. I'm saying, take your time and grow. There is no way at this season that God will not point you to a tutor and a governor. The people who would prepare you in the ways that you ought to be prepared. Whether they're people you have access to in person or they're virtual, whatever. 
you if god has pointed you to a well to drink from make sure you drink make sure you show up make sure you do the things that you're supposed to do make sure make sure make sure you are aligned do not just get up and go renegade do not just get up and try to exercise what you don't have to give a man can't give what he doesn't have don't allow yourself to be pressured and begin to try dabbling is not god god is very purposeful because i have seen this before every time we go through things like this the first thing that happens is people begin to print cards and they erect signboards you know how i know those things they don't have capacity for them because six months one year maybe on a good day two years something would happen to them and that thing would so shake them that you see them taking their hands off the plow as if something burnt them many years ago someone said to me that god told him to go and be ordained somewhere so he went through the school of ministry school and everything and he was ordained then they posted him somewhere. That was when he realized that all this flash and dash, people grow into flash and dash. And he was complaining bitterly about the ministry where he was serving. How that they don't, um, they don't pay enough, how that they don't do this, how that they don't do that. And I told him to go and get a job. I told him, you don't have to be in full-time ministry. You know, that is ministry where you are not doing anything else but staying in a church office every day. I told him, you don't have to do that if you don't have the grace for it. He said, but I've been ordained. I said, go back and resign so that you can grow before you get into things. Do not allow people to send you to go and do work that you have not built capacity for. He's still on the journey. He's still on the journey. Brethren, I don't want anyone skipping steps. I don't want anyone making mistakes. I know some people, 20 something years ago when I started, some people would have gone to look for a Reverend Yomi Kasali immediately. But sometimes when you build capacity, God brings the thing that you need to you. Do not be so focused on getting a YouTube channel. <laughs> that you don't build capacity on the inside. Because if I will borrow from my big sister, the demons in the region you are going to, they know you. You may not know them. And they don't just go to sleep. They usually would throw up a resistance. And every time the devil throws up a resistance, he tries to lay his hands on the things that are most precious to you. Don't let that be your story. You see, when you begin to talk about people be, being generous in the kingdom, I don't know what it means. I want you to know that the, the decoration, the stripes and the peeps and whatever, the, and the eagles and the stars and whatever that they, makes them a general. Brethren, they pay the price for it. So rather than be asking God, where am I going to shine? I'm going to ask you to ask him. Where will I be buried now? Because if you did not hear it, hear it now. A grain of wheat would only abide by itself or a grain of maize or whatever. But if it falls in the ground and it dies, 
<coughs> then it will bring forth a harvest. Your first step is go to go through the dying process. Dying processes don't have cameras turned on them. Dying processes don't have people clapping. Those who go through dying processes have nothing to show on their YouTube and Instagram channels and all of those channels you are, you are forging right now. All of those things don't matter. Now, here's the thing. Those who know me up close and personal, most of them, when I tell them, no, this is actually where you stop doing anything and you go and sit down and take paper and biro and learn, 80% of them get upset and they leave because the thing that the devil does when he hears that God has said that you should show him his glory. I think this is what I've been trying to say to you. The thing the devil does is that he shows you the clear lights and he says, God said you should show him your glory. You need to get a light now. The thing the devil does is he brings you to the flash and the dash. He says to you, now men will begin to talk about you. So this is the way. No, brethren, the first step to glory is death. Because otherwise what will happen is what happened in the seven, to the seven sons of Sceva. The devil will make a public show of you. Let that not be your portion. I'm not trying to scare you. I'm just trying to get us to walk this thing one step after the other. Now you know, go sit down and learn. Stop skimming off the top of food. Because that's what most of us do. We skim off, we take a new, a, a couple of new words into our, our Christian asena, our Christianese asena, and we move on to the next thing. No, this is the time where you begin to eat everything to get to the bottom of the pot, to see what, how that thing was made. This is beyond, you know, just ordering the food. This is going to the market to start the process of cooking the food. Do not be deceived. God is not mocked. This was the same authority that Jesus gave in, in, Mark, in Mark chapter 16. But there were people the authority was given to. There were people who were just trying to borrow it for a minute. So they would say, oh God of somebody. What do you mean by oh God of somebody? Is it not supposed to be all our God and all of our Father? Uh, all, uh, uh, God to all of us and God to uh, Father to all of us. What are you doing? And then you get angry when the man who's done the work is calling the shots over the work that he has done. People get angry. If you want to be able to call the shots, how about you go do your work? Jesus I know, Paul I know, but who are you? If you're on this prayer call and you've not given your life to Jesus, brethren, let's come back. That's where you start from. To jump on Instagram and begin to prophesy is not where it starts from. Where it starts from is to go back to the basics. <clears throat> to take a three-month course is not enough. This journey takes years. It takes decades. Brethren, if you want to be able to dispense glory and shine, how about you say with me this morning, Lord Jesus, I give you my life. If you are yet to give your life to Jesus. And for the rest of us, how about you begin to pray earnestly today and say, Father, bring me to my tutor and my governor. 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 Brethren, it is the day to become an accountable church of God. A lack of accountability will kill us. I want you to pray and say, Lord, bring me to my tutor and my governor. 
Help me to hear their sound and recognize it. Help me to go submit again. And when you do it like that, you will have no need to cut corners. You have no need to want to be where you are not called to be. You, are no, you have no need to try to show forth. You have no need for many things. Is there anyone giving their lives to Jesus today? Pray and say, Lord Jesus, I give you my life. Lord Jesus, I give you my life. Lord Jesus, I give you my life. No need, Lord Jesus, I give you my life. Lord Jesus, I give you my life. Is there anyone? Is there anyone? If you have been in ministry before and you've hit a snag and you've lost your way, it is because you did not wait to be properly prepared. Even if you've done 10 years or 15 years. But you know right now that where you're supposed to be, that the things that surround you now is not your life. You feel like you've been locked up in something and you can't find your way out. The prayer today is for you. Lay it all down and say, Father, take me back to the place where I skipped a step that I might make myself ready. I'm not sure if I communicated God's heart this morning because I am slow. <clears throat> I'm not sure if I communicated his heart. But I am grateful that you have Holy Spirit and Holy Spirit by himself would work it out for you. Brethren, do not be deceived. Some of the glory, that's, the, the glory that God expects from some of you is the capacity to sit down in one place and take instructions. And that will be all the glory in God needs from your life in this season. For some of the us, it will be the glory to follow instructions and follow them well. It will be all the glory that we, God needs. For others of us, it will be to go back to your family and be a good husband and be a good wife. It will be all the glory that God needs out of your life. For some of you, it will be to go back to where you broke something and go and repent and apologize and submit. It will be all the glory that God requires from you in this season. Do not make this about the clerk lights. Make this about the one that you know. Because the demon in the territory, they know you. You may not know them. Father Lord, I pray for myself and I pray for my brothers and sisters. Lord, that we will not jump the gun. Lord, we give you permission that your spirit will reign us in. Every single time we want to skip steps. Lord, let us know you before we try to go out and do you. Father, let your name be glorified. Lord, we worship you. Lord, we give you all the praise. Thank you, God of heaven. In Jesus' mighty name, amen and amen. Brethren, we still have slots for the power of the mind, retreat, and course. And it is next weekend. So if you want to get in on it, you, this is the time to get in on it. I think we have two or three slots left. It is time to get in on it. May God grant you grace in Jesus' name. The books are still available. Thank you to all of you who have ordered. If you have not ordered, please order and order for your friends. And um, if you would like to, no, let me not say that yet. Yes, these are the things that are available right now. May God bless you. Brethren, stop running. Submit. And don't submit 20%. 
if you submit 90%, it is not submission. You either have submitted or you are not submitted. There's nothing like, I submit 2% here, I submit 4% here. May the Lord give you wisdom. And may you hear his sound out of the many words I've spoken today. Whatever is not useful to you, may you also be able to discard it in this moment. May we not fail God. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen and amen. Thank you again. God bless you. And may those blessings manifest in Jesus' name.